Hello guys, and welcome back to some more survival of the Yoshi. It's nice starting the episode off here though. I might do that every time. This is nice, surrounded by everything. Anyway, let's start off with some stuff to do today, shall we? Beginning off today, firstly, I was going to finish up my wheat farm, and I was looking at this. You know, I actually really like it without any kind of fence around it or anything. So all I'm going to do instead, you know, in fact, this is just kind of off the top of my head on a whim right now anyway. Because I was kind of going to just leave it as it is. But looking at it, let me grab a hoe. And let me also grab some seeds. I don't know what I was going to use this chest for. Oh my god, the voice. I don't know what I was going to use this chest for. But now it's apparently just a dump chest. I remember placing it down last episode for something. And for some reason it's completely slipped my mind. But whatever. So let's... Oh no, that's actually the wrong one. Jump on it! Blah! This is actually the way we need to do it. So I'm just going to keep going across here. And placing farms down for some reason. I really like this setup. It's nice. No fence. But actually, would that work next to a tree? I don't know, it should, right? I'm kind of tempted to see. Let's place it down and find out scientific experiments in Minecraft. Not really. So, when it comes to the wheat farm, I think that's actually kind of what I'm going to leave it as. It looks nice, at least in my mind. Just don't argue with it. Next thing that I might want to do, and I don't know why I said might, because I am going to do it. Let's look at this bit here, guys. You see that? Isn't that just a beautiful piece of mountain? Well, I think so. Now, if you remember the water base that we had on this world... Above the water base, I had a kind of lookout, towery, shooty, spidery kind of area. I don't know, that summed it up just great, didn't it? I had something like that, though. I was thinking, you know what, we could really use something like that down here, too. So, what I'm going to do to, again, have it as a lookout and mob shooty kind of area is from the bottom here where I first showed you this, just just, just underneath there, I want to have kind of like a doorway go in, a ladder go up all the way through this mountain, and then at the top here, I want to build off like this kind of looking area, just, just off the side of the mountain. And we're going to try and do that. So before I do try and do that, I'm actually going to try and jump in the water because there's no easy way down from here. But before I do that, I do actually need to sleep because... Ooh, that's close. Oh my god, that was by one block! I shouldn't have taken that risk. <laughs> I'm playing risky today, guys. You know how things end up when I play risky. Especially on Survival of the Yoshi. Do you remember the spider incident last time? Screw the current middle layers. We're going to go right to the top. And we're just going to try and get the top chest. That's all I... <gasps> no! <laughs> okay, maybe I should have... Maybe I should have seen that coming. Oh, I hear zombies outside. It's dead. No, don't be standing on my crops. Okay, yeah, maybe. Maybe that zombie was there to teach us a lesson. Maybe we do need fences around them. We'll come to that a bit later, but no, I, I didn't think of the whole mob thing. God damn it, Minecraft. Why have you got to have challenge a difficulty? Gah. I think I kind of summed up what I want to do there, right? And that's what I want to start off doing today. So, let's get everything we're going to need for it. I'm going to need to get a crap ton of wood again, probably, because I have no sticks to make any ladders. I mean, I, I could demolish the ones down in there. No, I'm not going to take extra... It's not that hard to make ladders, Yoshi. Come on. I actually need to get some stone and just kind of everything else, actually. So... Never mind, take what I just said with a little pinch of, binch, a little pinch of salt. We'll be going and doing that in a second. Firstly, we're going to go and get some stuffs. This is kind of an issue now. I don't, I, I don't really know where to go to get stuffs. Because there are no resource areas around here, at least for stone. Oh, oh, maybe, maybe aside from this, I haven't seen this before. Hold on, what's... Oh my god, there's there's a skeleton in there. That, that's good. That means this could be a cave or just a pathway through to another outside area. You know, that's happened way too many to Oh, no, maybe it hasn't happened. I was about to say it's happened way too many times for my liking now and it's it's actually kind of getting ridiculous. This area, seriously, can you can you reward me with some No, I was right. It is it just keeps screwing us over. I'm, I'm getting to the point where I think Minecraft knows what it's doing. I think there's some other higher power in the survival of the Yoshi world. Somehow that came in between when I last left off and when I started it back up again in Season 2. Although actually it could have been there before because it's not like we were fail free before. But there's some kind of landscaping god that's just chilling up in the sky. 
I bet you the moment I come out of here, he goes and hides. Or, or she, to be fair. Could be either of them. Who knows, man? This is Minecraft, and that cloud kind of looks like a penis and a ball, so... I mean, it could be anyone. In fact, if you got this part of the cloud and placed it over there, <laughs> and placed it over there, it would literally be a penis in the sky. I think that's his or her way of sending us a message, guys. Landscaping God says fuck you. Okay, then. Oh, and I've just realized I didn't bring any food out to this excursion that isn't really doing anything. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. Oh, and I didn't bring a goddamn axe either. Think things ahead, Yoshi. Think things through. Right, well, I'll tell you what I'm gonna do then instead. I'm just gonna grab a bunch of wood. I still don't know what I want this little viewing tower platform to be made out of. That's why I went out on this. And I can just see out the corner of my eye. I'm not gonna look at it. But if you guys look at the corner of our, uh, of our eyes, on the right-hand side, you can see the dirt tower up the battle tower that uh, led us to our spidery end last time. Painful memories coming in. Ugh. I'm just gonna get a bunch of wood and then figure out what I want this bit of viewing tower to be made out of. As I was saying, it could be stone. I could go with that kind of classical style. It's not gonna be dirt. I want it to stand out from the mountain. But I don't really know what else. I mean, we could go and find another kind of wood and have a different colored wood in it. And that would actually look quite cool. I'm really, you know, I, yeah. I didn't think of that until I just said that. And now that's growing on me very quickly. I think I'm going to go and do that. I mean, just kind of like this. What's this one? I always call this acacia wood. And I know it's not. What, which one is it? Butch! I should know this! Oh, God! Seriously, troll me in the comments for not knowing my Minecraft tree types. Right? Because everyone knows those. And yeah, actually, I think kind of probably everyone does now. Anyway, actually, you know, going in search for other kinds of trees, if birch isn't what we want, though, kind of ties in with the third thing that I was going to do today for the rest of the episode, which was actually just go further in the direction behind my house. Uh, so just this way, really. Just to see what else lies beyond us there, because obviously this is all new chunks. The only new chunk that I've really fully explored is this chunk that my house is in. So, I'm thinking if we keep going further, one, we might be able to find some actual caves. Which I'm not going to turn down. I think it's about time we got some diamonds in this game again. And two, we can also just see what other kind of biomes and trees and monsters perhaps lie out there for us. Because there are some mods in this server. or Well, this game. This isn't a server. This game that kind of tie into that as well. I guess if I can find my house again, that's what we're going to go and do now. I've already got a bunch of standard wood, so I should have enough for the ladders up to the viewing tower. And then, yeah, all that leaves is the viewing tower material itself, which we need for the exploration. So we're going to switch things up. We'll actually be returning to the house today. That's what kind of spawned the idea of having a viewing tower here for me as well, while I'm Going back over there actually just to grab some food because, again, I nearly forgot about that. That's what kind of spawned the idea of having a viewer tower in this game for me. Originally, I thought, ah, oh, right, well, if I'm going exploring, because my house is actually kind of between three large hills slash mountains, however you want to kind of class them. I don't get getting geographically accurate here. Woo! Yeah, that's, that's, that's exciting stuff. Oxbow Lakes. Probably one of the only geographical words that I could name right now. Oxbow Lakes! Yeah, they're, they're, they're great. Wait, wait. Is this an Oxbow Lake? I mean, it looks like a bow. It goes... Oh, my God, we have an Oxbow Lake. Relevance in my videos. What is happening? Well, let me make a crap ton of poop sticks then. I, I, I don't know why they're poop sticks. I don't think you should question why they're poop sticks. Poop sticks! are the kind of thing you never question. You just let them be. And if you ask about them, well, that, that you know, that's just out of order. You, you don't, you don't do that. And apparently I don't know how to make the ladder. So there we go, 24 ladders. That should be enough on its own, honestly. But instead, just in case, let me make an extra three, 27. Nice. I can't see us needing any more than 27 ladders. So I'm actually just going to save those sticks for a letter date. Um, I do need some food, though. And what do we have? We have everything that is uncooked. So we're not going on the journey just yet. We need to cook up some food. There we go. We are all fooded up. We've got that foodage going in our mouthage. And it's traveling down into our bellage. Well, that, that last one didn't sound great. Okay. Uh, <laughs> Let's keep going on then. Now, Birchwood. This is what I wanted to check out. I know the color of this. It's the light one, isn't it? Yes. Well, I, I just confirmed that with myself. 
I don't know if that's the wood I'm searching for here. I kind of want the darker one. And I can't think exactly which one that is. I'm pretty... Isn't that jungle wood? Yeah. It's jungle wood that I want. Mmm. Okay, well, that's very specific. I mean, we have to go out and not just find new areas and new biomes, but also a full-on dungeon. Uh, okay. I'm gonna make a bucket because we might as well have one. If I can fill it up with some water, I can use it as a quick technique to get out of maybe a high place that I'm in or something. Just for a bit of safety, man. I'm preparing. This doesn't happen usually with me, but, but I'm doing it today. And the adventure begins. I have no idea what to expect. I'm really excited as well. We haven't had a proper run around for a while and just explore on survival of the Yoshi session. And clearly that was the most efficient way to say that phrase. Um, since, I mean, we haven't had one in season two. So I think that kind of speaks for itself. But what are we looking for today? I've already kind of gone over it. But just as a little reminder, the two main things we're looking for today. Well, no, there are three things. One, a very nice open genuine cave that actually goes down under. What are you doing here? Why have you frozen my game? What are you? Yeah, what? Creeper. What? Okay, I don't know what that's gonna look like for you guys because my game literally just froze mid-jump for a, a good amount of time there. But I that creeper is... No. Is that creeper the landscaping lord? The almighty landscaping lord in the sky that has a micro penis there, and I don't know why I'm seeing penises in clouds suddenly, but apparently I am. It's the it's the landscaping god! He just blew himself up! His wrath is great! Ah, see, we're already discovering new things. Look at this. We've got some blue flowers. That's new. We got some what are these water reeds? You can't even break them underwater. Damn, this is fancy. Okay, well, I'm just pointing out very basic things in the landscape right now. The landscape lord is sending me loopy. Where did the landscape lord come from? All of a sudden. It just started in this episode. Whoa! Oh, that looks cool. There's oh my oh, why did I why? Why did I not build my house here? If only, if only I just walked a little bit further. There are donkeys that are chilling with chickens and baby donkeys. Like, this is awesome. Oh, my game. Okay. Minecraft really doesn't like me today. I'm not going to quit. I'm going to wait for it to keep doing this. There's something around here that's causing me to lag, maybe. Who knows? Maybe we'll see what it is. After we go after oh, above here, I don't even know. This is what the hell? There's a water bit up here, and this is oh okay. So this is a whole new plane of land. It's it's not actually a mountain. It's a plane of land. This is just the height of the land from now on. Oh my god! I was such an idiot not to place anything down here or just to find it. Oh, I I, I love that feeling of regret. You know what? No, no. We have a beautiful house with a beautiful location and a beautiful. Wheat farm so far is kind of the only thing I can really think of that's also there aside from the house I mean, I think it is there like a cave under this. We might have to check this out. There's lava spewing out of it So that's something ah, Okay, we'll keep on going on though. I don't want to just stop at the first cool thing I see I want to get as much as I can and then we'll choose from there that looks really really cool But we won't check that out now. I'm almost a hundred percent sure and I don't know why this has come up This has already come up in one episode of Survival of the Yoshi Season 2 at some point. I don't know which one it was, but I, I explicitly remember talking about it. And now it's come up already in this episode, and it's coming up again. But Oxbow Lake! Or River. One of the two. Just tell me I'm right. Oh, hello there, you beautiful cave. You're the kind of thing I'm... Well, let me not say that too early. You may be the kind... You're not the kind of thing I'm looking for. However, you actually have a really good amount of iron, so I'd be an idiot not to take that. Hello, babies. How you, I don't know why I'm suddenly talking to everything as if it's my child. Oh, hello, iron. Uh, I hope that's not how I would talk to my child. In the creepiest, most pedo -y voice I could think of. Oh, God, I should not become a parent. We've taken all the iron from there. That didn't actually lead to anything. It looked cool. That's the issue with this area, it seems. Everything looks really, really, really cool. Like my favorite kind of Minecraft land generation. But then you go down into it or you go on it and you explore. And next thing you know, oh, right, it's a dead end. Or, oh, there are spiders literally raining down from the sky. Or, ah, oh, my Minecraft's going to freeze again, which it hasn't done in years. 
Ah! I'm done. That's probably because it hasn't genned in yet, but I'm I'm still really curious. Uh, to be no, to be fair, I'm getting closer and closer, and it's still not doing it. That looks like a battle tower that didn't fully complete itself. Yeah, we 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 gotta check that out. What? I mean, does that mean it will be uber easy, or will it be like depressed in down into the ground, or is it something else? I mean, it doesn't actually look like a battle tower. It sounds like it has a lot of stuff in it. Yeah, yeah, there, there's there's a lot of stuff in that. Tell you what, let's build our way just up it. I have my bucket of water, so I'm all safe. Oh, oh, right away. Um, okay, I, uh, I, I was not expecting to have to take spawners down right away. Although it's in daylight. Okay, we just got a double chest with. Oh my god, why am I getting such poor loot? Yeah, it looks like this is literally down in the ground. That is amazing. I'm not going to tackle it right now because we found out what happened last time. I am not ready to be tackling any kind of battle tower just yet. But we're going to have to come back to this one. That's really, really cool. And also that water strat, though. And now we're into swamp territory. I don't know if I really want to explore some of that. I'm not a major swamp fan. I don't know why. And the thing I'm really not a fan of is we haven't found... I'm, I'm really not a fan of my Minecraft freezing every, every minute. What are you doing? Oh my... Where did you all come from? Is that why it just froze? Did the sheep decide, hey, we're going to spawn in an extra five of ourselves. Excuse... And why did that lag me out? Oh, hold on. Hold on. What? No, that couldn't be. It couldn't be. No, it couldn't be. We got a mossy battle tower right over there. On like an island. Nope, in the water. Some of the places these spawn, I've got to say, are really, really cool. They they make you want to check them out. Like, you don't just wander by that in Minecraft and think, Oh, okay, well, I'll just... I'll just check that out a bit later, even though that's what I'm having to think. But you, you don't do that. It's a tower coming out of the water, which is in the swamp. You check that out. <laughs> oh, okay. Um, now, I can't really reenact that, and I wasn't expecting that, but... I, I just kind of started jumping over this, and I saw like a little gap, and then I looked down, and suddenly it's possibly, genuinely possibly, the biggest quarry I may have ever seen in Minecraft, completely concealed up until here. Oh my god! This is the exact kind of thing that we were looking for. We might have just struck real gold here, guys. We have our water bucket as well. We can get down into it. Before we go down into it, let me just kind of survey the area out a tiny bit more just to see what's here. I should probably kill some pigs, actually. I mean, I know it won't be cooked food, but I need some of that. Also, that's something I really, really want to get again. In Minecraft, on Survival of the Yoshi, I don't know why I specified that it was Minecraft, but in Survival of the Yoshi, <gasps> I think that's jungle tree wood. Okay, thank God I did survey the area out. Is it? Is it? Oh, God. Detention. Don't even say it isn't now. Dark oak wood, I don't, yes, that's not jungle wood, but yes, I'll go with that. It, it's close enough. And, and actually, now we can check out the quarry and it's getting dark and, oh, poop. And I've kind of lost track of where my house is as well. Can I just mention that now in case later in the episode when we're trying to go back, we have issues with that? Yeah. I mean, maybe we need to be out for a whole night now in Survival of the Yoshi. We haven't done that yet. We haven't survived a night outside slash in a quarry, and we're looking for stuff for mob sandwiches. So that kind of ties in. Yeah, screw it. I'm going to stick around here for the night, get everything done that I need to do now, just in the night time, and then we'll head back. Oh my god, there's a double quarry. Hold on. Hold on. Does this lead the whole way around or something? No, it can't. Oh, no, it doesn't. Okay, there's there's two big, big quarries right by each other. Okay. Even more to check out then. And a little cave there or something. Oh, God. Now we got to start actually looking for monsters. There's probably going to be more in the quarry as well. There's already a skelly over here. Can I dodge him? Can I dodge him? No, no, I can't. No, I, I really can't. Oh, yeah, why don't we just get a bunch of seeds? Not that these are rare for some reason. I don't know why I'm treating it like that. But, yeah, let's get a bunch of seeds. Woo! 
No, what the hell was that? No. No, you don't... You don't do that to me, Minecraft. I think the worst part about it was that there was no visual aid going on. I think it would have been nicer if I saw the monster. That was either an Enderman doing something and just creeping around invisibly, or something else. And I don't want to think if it's something else. I mean, there is an Enderman there, but... Yeah, seriously, that... that yeah. It wasn't nice, man! I'm just gonna jump into that water stream there. I have my water to get back up. I'll be alright, so... Actually, let me just eat up before I do that as well. Seriously, nothing is coming to attack me yet? Again, not that I'm really complaining. I don't want to make it seem like I'm complaining about something like that. But very, very weird. Huh. No. Let's go. Oh, yes. Skill displaying. Okay, right. Let's go and find some stuff then, shall we? Please say this has something good. Just... Just something. I mean, this. yeah, this, yes, yes, this, yes, this is it. No, no. Oh, my God, he can actually shoot from there. No, that that's not the kind of thing I want. Ah, he's in the lava. Yes, yes, that's the, okay. Commentary is really, really on point right now. Yes, yeah, dog, yes. Let's build our way around here then, screw it. I should have brought a bow with me or something, or I need to get a bow. I've got a lot of arrows from skeletons I've killed, but I haven't had a bow drop yet. I'm kind of hoping for one as well, because obviously, I'm not going to use a full one as a bow, because it's kind of used. However, if we get one from a skelly that we can use while we're down here, I mean, I won't I won't be complaining about that. And wow, I really nearly just stepped into that lava. There you go. Oh, oh, we found a dungeon. Oh, there we go. The first dungeon find, everybody. Of season two, check this out. Oh my god, and this is out of all the. It's got to be a skelly dungeon, hasn't it? Of, of course it has. Of course it has. Okay, go down. There you go. Don't care that you're gonna come back up and get us. It doesn't matter. Just destroy you. Hold on. No. 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 Don't be ripping me off. Where the hell are my chests? No. Okay. Here's all I'm gonna say. There better be some goddamn chests under this gravel. Seriously, I've never found a dungeon without chests before, guys, and I don't want to start now. This is the first dungeon find of season two. It's not looking like there are chests. This is the first one of season two, and there are no chests in it. When does that happen? No. I'm, oh, I'm under the impression that they've still got to, like, be somewhere. But if they're not in here, then they're not going to be here, are they? Here's what's happened. This is probably where the chests would have been. But because the dungeon spawned in such a stupid location, it didn't fully spawn. It just, the, the, the actual landscape overtook the bit where the chests were. But luckily, the spawner and monsters were still there. Oh, come on. That is the cheapest dun- And I didn't even get my XP. You see that? Did you did you see that? Just to add insult to injury, rub salt in the wounds, smack your face, in other words. My XP just got burned as well with it. Wow! Douchebag dungeon! That's what you are! It's the only suitable name for you! Douchebag dungeon. To make up for it, we better find some goddamn good stuff around here. Although, actually, to be fair, this is probably the first actual low-down cave that we have found. I'm, I'm pretty happy about it. I can't be compl- Oh, no, we're good. We're good. Thank God we went to that battle tower. That was what that was from. I was thinking, when, when did I get that? Okay, at least we- I mean, we could make one down here, to be fair. It wouldn't be the end of the world. But let's just avoid all the lava going even further down, which I am a fan of. That's some diamond territory right there. Okay, it's kind of looking like the end, but there's a possibility. No, okay, well, that's the end of the dungeon. Or cave. It's not even a dungeon. We found a dungeon. I'm, I'm not going to go on to that again. Mm. I don't think I've ever been more ripped off in Minecraft. Genuinely. Freaking douchebag dungeon. Oh my god, that's... Oh, yuck. There's a third quarry, which is a second one underneath the first. We're not going home yet. We're going right into this. Oh my god, this looks the best one. This looks like the best one so far. I feel like there could be some diamonds down here, guys. I don't know why. Do you ever... There's, there's a bat on fire. There's just a bat on fire. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? I mean, it's kind of a rare thing. 
you see? Oh, oh, there's some redstone. That's always a nice sign. I don't know why I'm doing this. <gasps> there it is. We found some diamond. Oh, I'm so glad I didn't go home yet. Can we block this off and just actually be safe for a while? No. Are you, are you going to be that water? Are you going to be that guy? Water. Really? You're going to be that guy? The guy that flows through, you know, completely sealed blocks. Oh, are you that guy? The one that creeps around the corner and then blames it on another piece of water. Yeah, you're that guy. This was the guy all along. But diamond! Oh, we don't have an iron pick. Let's make this iron pick really quickly so we can harvest this lovely, lovely diamond. Hopefully plural. I doubt it. But is it? Is it? No, it's a single diamond. There you go. Also, we just got an achievement. Nice. I don't know why I didn't have that on here before. But hey, I'm not complaining. Maybe they reset for season two. Could have actually happened. I didn't check up on that, but there you go. We have achievements now and we have diamonds and there is something really cool. Okay, there looks like there's a cave in here. Oh my <laughs> I really want to spend another episode here guys. I really do. I might have to make that cool. We'll see. Oh, no, I can't get around there. Oh, there's another cave in here. Yes. Yes. Th this is where we needed to be the whole time. Let's Let's go down this way. See if we can find any Diamonds, there's a bunch of lapis. Th two! There's two more already! Okay, nearly wrong pickaxe. Alright, three! Oh my god, we're up to four. Five! Please, please. <laughs> no, okay, there's not a six. Okay, suddenly we're at six diamonds. Yep, there's no complaining going on. Um, I think that's something around there. I, I'm looking around as if I can go around in Minecraft. This ain't some Oculus Rift yet, Yoshi. I need to get that though. I really need to get an Oculus Rift. It's been on my radar for a long time, but alas, they are expensive and rare. And, well, not rare, but harder to get than most products. Okay, any more diamonds? I think, you know what guys? Here's what we're gonna do. I hate to, oh, oh, here we go. It's all popping off now. There's a skeleton somewhere. You were the one I was worried about. This... Oh yeah, yeah, we saw that before. What the hell is that? What the hell is that? That confirms it. There you go, that confirms it. I thought I saw something like this. I really did. I, I was sure that I saw something like that when we were doing a battle tower, but I couldn't verify it. I went in editing, I saw something go down, but you know, my sword was blocking the graphic a bit. I couldn't see it. What was that? I think it's, I think, I think it's best just to not question it. Just to carry on as if nothing happened. I've been given slowness. I think that was probably from the spider actually, but nothing, nothing happened there. We didn't see anything, did we? No, no. Uh, every single time that I was complaining about caves being poopy doos, this is exactly, I don't know what that word means. This is exactly what I was looking for. So I, I, I'm just like a full on kid in a candy store right now. And as I was about to say before some horrifying mutant skeleton being attacked us, I didn't plan on doing this today. I didn't. But I think you guys are going to know what I'm going to say. We're going to spend the rest of the episode today just in here a bit as well, checking some more bits out. And then next episode, we'll start off... Oh my god, the lava is everywhere! Next episode, we will start off in here. We'll finish up any things we have to do. And then at the end... Well, we'll finish off next episode by heading back home, doing the viewing tower, probably doing another bit of work to the house as well. This is too big. I've looked for something for this, like, so long. I can't pass up this opportunity. So, I'll tell you what. I'm going to grab... Hmm... No, I'm not going to grab some redstone. Yoshi, do not fool yourself into pretending like you're going to be technical enough to be doing redstone, especially this early on. It's like when a person gets glasses for the first time, I would imagine. They put them on, they think that they look uber smart, and then they realize that actually they're just glasses. Oh, yeah, I could use redstone because I'm digging it up. I'm, I'm, I'm really clever. Oh, no, wait. Well, I don't know how to do it. Yeah. I really do need to learn. I remember when... Really early days of Minecraft. We're talking alpha alpha kind of days. Oh, definitely get this gold as well. Golden apple hope. However, I remember those kind of days. I remember when the first person did something with redstone that was amazing. It was just a calculator, but it fully worked and it was really, really crazy. I remember seeing that and I had a mental note. And I still remember this mental note to this day, which is even worse that I remember it because the fact that I remember it and I still haven't acted upon it, and I do remember it like three years later. Just is, I don't even know what that says about me. 
God damn it, Yoshi. But I made a mental note to really try and learn a lot of redstone. And that nearly ended up horribly. To try and learn a lot of redstone things, you know. To try and get really good at it. Three years later, and I still struggle with TNT cannons. Yeah, I totally accomplished my goals. I mean, what's the first thing I'm going to make with my diamonds? Let me really think about this. Because if it's a pick, I could just make it now and get some of this obsidian because we could put that towards a food. A, a food? A food. What? We could put that towards an enchanting table, Yoshi. I don't know where you were going with that. Yeah, I think that's what I'm going to do. I mean, I have two. I'll have two left over once I've made it anyway. So I'm not completely without diamonds. And I guess we can put those towards some boots or something. Because the next thing after this, actually, I guess we can put those towards the enchanting table. Because we're going to need to, aren't we? We need to put at least one of them. So one of those will go to the enchanting table then after this. I'm going to seal this water off. I don't know why I didn't do that to begin with. Because seriously, that's just, that's just dumb, man. Hopefully there's not lava under here, by the way. But... I guess we'll see. Now, I think it's four obsidian for enchanting table, right? Because it's three on the bottom, all obsidian, and then one in the middle. I'm going to take five, I think, just to be safe. Just so I know I'll have enough. Because actually, we could put that towards an uh, end portal as well. We haven't made one of those yet. And not an end portal, an obsidian portal. That could be cool. We could get some nether stuff going on again here in Survival of the Yoshi 2, which we definitely do need to soon at some point at least. I'll dig this one up. So... Hey, we could do that. All right, I've got five. However, this did catch my eye over here. There's redstone there. And I feel like there might be a tiny, smaller little area, maybe with some diamonds or something, if you want to give me some diamonds. You want to give me some diamonds, Minecraft gods? Do you want to do, do that for me at all? Any, anything at all? Just just anything. Just a, a single diamond. Just, just one. A single... Nope, nothing. Okay. Whew. Well, I think I will finish this episode off here then, guys. Thank you very, very much for watching this episode of Survival of the Yoshi. I hope you did enjoy it. Next episode, we will continue and finish temporarily until the next time we come over here. Our beautiful quarry caving experience. Still to do, we have the rest of this quarry. I also do want to go back and check out the quarry that we came to this one from up there because I think there might be another area that we still need to check out there. We also have the other quarry that we have to go back up to the overworld to access which is a completely different adventure tomorrow as well. We have that bit up there I'd like to check out. That bit there as well. Um, another bit down there. All of this over here. There's a lot of caving to check out. We are well and truly making up for the lack of caving that happened up until this episode. It's all just come out at once and boy is it glorious. Stay tuned for next episode. Until then, don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. I've been Yoshi Mario, and I will see you all a little bit later.